kind of platforms actually provide uh, a great level of interaction between uh, the user, the decision maker, the influencer and uh, solution offering companies. So this uh, platform uh, also provides an understanding of both the sides. You know, uh, we generally come across um, uh, only the user part of the story or uh, the company is offering solutions part of the story, but this platform gives one single platform to understand both sides. In a smart city environment, especially in the context of Indian smart cities, is um, uh, India being a democracy, all the purchases happens through tendering process. Now I come from an industry which is more or less commoditized. So the decision making for an end user uh, becomes very difficult when on paper everything or every product offered looks the same. So my urge to the decision makers through this forum is to look beyond the data sheet. You know that is what I presented as well. It, on papers they all look the same but uh, the factors like the originality, uh, the cyber security aspect, uh, the expertise that a company brings from their global ex exposure are some of the things which uh, I intend to drive uh, uh, as a point to the user. So I would uh, want um, leaders like World Bank who is into funding and things like that to do an amount of uh, research for what kind of a product, what kind of solution fits in, what kind of requirements that would solve a customer need. Here we are talking about smart cities. So every smart city is nothing but uh, a, a bunch of products and solutions uh, which is driven towards achieving a more um, convenience to the user level. So end of the day, all this is a bunch of products and solutions. So um, people have to do um, research before they actually adopt those technologies. Any amount of uh, complexity could be solved if there is a little bit of understanding of the problem and by thorough research. So the amount of uh, ICT expertise that the World Bank has could be leveraged to understand the problems that the users are today facing and how you link it between the product and solutions are, that are available in the market. Smart city is a process. It's, it's, it's not a destination that you, you start today and end in 24 months or 36 months. It's, it's a continuous process. So, uh, and it, it does not also mean that uh, you know, if things go wrong, you stop it, right? So you learn from the mistakes. So this process has to be a continuous one and an ongoing one. And um, as the pace of urbanization uh, increases globally and uh, with a special reference to India, the urban, urbanization is growing at a, such a rapid pace so the, uh, the process of smart city um, evolvement cannot stop in 24 months or 36 months. It's, it's, it's an ongoing process.